Hi guys, welcome you again to another today's news. Still on the issue of the Koji prison attack. As we all know that, the issue has caused a lot of problem in Nigeria and we are still battling it. The Koji prison has led to a lot of fear in Nigeria because a lot of Nigerians now are scared. Now, because notorious terrorists now are now released and they are now among us. And these people, there's probability that they are going to return back to their former way of life and that could be terrible to the society. Now, it has been said that Buhari should take responsibility and address Nigerians directly and stop issuing press statements because our president is so used to press statements. Just imagine this kind of situation that has befell Nigeria and instead of you to come out and address the Nigerians yourself, you go through your media aids, you start issuing press statements. It ought not to be. This is our reaction by Senator Undumi saying that Buhari should take responsibility, accept this has happened, then address Nigerians directly and stop issuing praised statements. Well, we'll be going into the full details of the news and I'd like you to sit tight as we move. If you're coming across this channel for the very first time, don't just watch and leave the subscribe. And don't forget to turn on the bell icon to get you notified anytime we post a new update. And also a big shout out to our Disney subscribers. I want to say a big thank you to you for liking, sharing, commenting. I want to employ you to continue to do so. And as you do, you may blush. Now to the full gist of the news. The Senator representing Bono South in the National Assembly and Chairman Senate Committee on Army Ali Ondume has asked President Muhammad Buhari to address the Nigerians directly instead of issuing statements through his aides. The senator, during an interview on Channels TV on Thursday night, monitored by Sahara reporters, said the Buhari led government should take responsibility for the terrorist attack in the country as God will hold him accountable. On Tuesday, an advanced team in the president's convoy was attacked by terrorists in Castina State. On the same night, terrorists attacked Kuji Correctional Center, killing some of the inmates and an officer of the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps and SCDC. The harmed assassins also freed hundreds of inmates, including Boko Haram terrorists, held at the facility. The Islamic State West, you know, the Islamic State backed faction of Boko Haram, pardon, the Islamic State West African province, ISWAP, has claimed responsibility for Tuesday's attack on the prison facility. I saw in a video released on which they claimed responsibility for the attack. In a video, the terrorist sect showed some of the men shooting their way into the facility. Recently, there have been terrorist attacks on hard targets, including March 28th attack on a Cardinal board train in which no fewer than eight people were killed and several others were injured. Many passengers were also adopted by the terrorists with some of their victims still held in captivity three months after the incident. Antome said, the president is supposed to or whoever is responsible should sit some people down and get results not just making statements. When it comes to issues like this, it is the president himself that's supposed to be talking to Nigerians, not some advisors. 
the president, of course, and all of us religiously, by the time you take responsibility or you ask people to elect you as the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, anything that happens to any Nigerian, God will hold you responsible. God will hold you accountable for it. The president knows that. Indome said he was disappointed with the response of some leaders who failed to see the terrorist attack on Koji prison as their responsibility. I am really disappointed with the response of our leaders and it's our responsibility. The responsibility of government is the security and welfare of its citizens and then you have leaders responding as if it's a casualty. It's not their responsibility. It's our responsibility. I feel pained to be called a senator and I am almost like helpless and many of us are like that sitting down as observers, he said. According to Undome, the government is not doing enough on the issue of security as the police force is almost not existent. We are not going much, you know, we are not doing much, pardon, or we are not concentrating or we are not prioritizing the key issue of security in the government properly. Nigeria with over 2 million people, we have less than 400,000 police personnel and you have all the security agents put together at all. You know, at that, pardon, their numbers is not even up to 1 million. Go and check it. How can you police a country of 200 million with this? He asked. People come from wherever up to now. Today is nothing. No trace, no information, no situation room, nothing. The people that were adopted on the train attack, no information, nothing. I'm part of the government. I take responsibility. I'm just saying people are not responsible for what they are supposed to be responsible for. He added, what is your thought to this? What is your own reaction to this brain development? We would like you to share it with us via the comment section. We'd like you to let us know your own, you know, point of view to this. As you can see, a lot is happening in Nigeria. But Harry should take responsibility. Our government has failed after this incident has happened. No information, no traces, no sign, nothing, nothing. And we said they are working on it. People who, had, who ought to be held responsible are left and they are freed, of which is not supposed to be. No traces, no information, nothing, nothing, nothing to hold on to. We would like you to let us know your own point of view to this. We would like you to let us know your own reaction to this brain development concerning the Koji prison attack. A lot is happening. I feel sad each time I remember that APC, you know, refused to give Osibanjo the ticket and a reaction from Stella. We wouldn't be afraid of dealing with the Messiah consecutively again for the next eight years. Because if Tinobu should be the next president of Nigeria, then Something like this will continue to happen. What is your thought to this? Don't you think it's high time Buhari start to take responsibility and address Nigerians by himself and not going through media aids or issuing press statements? According to what Senator Ondome have said. Or oh, like you to let us know your own thoughts today. Thank you guys for listening. Subscribe to this channel if you have not. And I will see you on the other news. Bye for now.